<laughs> Staying with Maryland Athletics for just a second, some members of the football team from the Baltimore area are trying to prove they don't have the accent by saying the phrase, Aaron earned an iron urn. Take a look. Iron, urn, and iron, urn. Aaron earned an iron urn. Aaron earned an iron urn. Aaron? Aaron. What does that word say? Aaron and iron urn. Bro, you just said the same word four times. Aaron? Aaron? That's Aaron. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Aaron. Aaron. There we go. Aaron, Aaron, and iron urn. That is so good. All right, Marina, the floor is yours. Go for it. Wait, where's the line? Right there. Aaron earned an iron urn. See, does that see, does that sound any different? No, it, you, you, it sounded Aaron very official coming from an you. Iron urn. I think it's hilarious. I think I, I I like that all these regions, even within like the same state, yeah. may have different accents. Like I think it makes it unique. I love hearing people with a southern accent, and, yeah. and you know we laugh about it. Like the other day we were laughing about Delco Murder Dirter and yeah. the SNL skit. Water. But yeah, but I think that the, it shows that people are from a, a place, and and there's a reason. You can't really explain why, but I mean, maybe we had a linguist here. Is, is there a DC and a, a Maryland? Is, is there a difference in the accent? I don't yeah. Well. Well, I, th I, don't, I don't know if DC, maybe. DC is such a melting pot that I don't mm -hmm. think that right. they're. I, I mean, I wouldn't but say. Washingtonians would probably tell you yes that they when they hear like people from Baltimore say hot dog, yeah. or you know parents things like that. <laughs> that that is like a little bit more Maryland. But then you know I, it's all kind of one and the same at well, some point. Well, then we got Sarah up there in Maine, where it's just people going ah oh, yeah yeah <laughs> yeah. Get there from here. <laughs> yeah. Can't get there from here. <laughs> I mean, Jersey certainly has an accent, but what about like Southern California? Is there something I, I, that's like I, unique to LA? No, I think it's the same thing like DC in that oh, it's no, a oh. melting pot. That yeah. nobody, and Sarah knows this, nobody uh, from LA is, uh, or nobody that lives in LA is it's from, from LA. Everyone's from different <laughs> places. So you you catch these weird, these strange accents that you wouldn't expect to hear around the city. But yeah, no, no, no LA accent. Well, just, uh, what about the Valley Girl though? Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, uh, what am I talking about? Yes. Yes. <laughs> well, yes. But, but, yeah. but that said, yeah. you're in L.A. and the Valley is not necessarily part of L.A. So, I mean, they are different geographical areas. Yeah. But I will say, it, yeah, it's, if you, yeah, got, it's if you far, got to L.A. It's far away, you, too. Yeah, if you go out to L.A. and you get directions from people, it's always like, you know, you take the 10 to the 405. You know, that sort Dude. of thing. So, and go. Michael just says, okay, gabagool. <laughs> 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 All right.